What's up, YouTube family? This is Jeff with Little Bit Everything Home Services coming to you with another video. So today, family, I figured I'd shoot this video um, to help somebody out there if you're in the same situation. Um, and if you look around, you see the rest of the curtains are hanging up. And uh, this one right here is not. It's on the ground. So what ended up happening is, you know, I, I got some of my boys a little more heavy handed than than everybody else. And they pulled the curtain too hard in and pulled, pulled off the hanger for the rod. You know, so since they pulled, it was just up with regular screws. They made the hole a little bit bigger. Uh, and so what I'm going to do today, I'm going to use these drywall anchors right here. I like these drywall anchors. They have different sizes. And uh, they, I, they come in many, many different sizes for different weight capacity on them. This one right here, I think it, it holds 50 pounds. You know, that curtain doesn't weigh that much. So uh, I'm going to use these and it puts a little bit smaller hole in. I like these um, because they're self-tapping. You just put them in and you screw them in and you're done. And uh, so um, it's really, really easy. I'll show you how it's done and get this curtain hung up. So I'll be right back. All right, family, I had to run downstairs and go get the other holder. I left it down there. But as you can see, originally this was just up with just drywall screws. Um, I don't I don't use anchors unless I have to. And a lot of times I'm able to get it on stud, so uh, I don't have to use an anchor. But once they come down, now I'm going to an anchor because the hole's already a little bit bigger. But like I said, it's really, really simple. All you got to do is you just unscrew. They come, they come with the screw. And the anchor and what ends up happening family is this it screws into here and it makes it it makes it bigger inside of here it splits it open and holds it in there you know so and these 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 metal bridges hold it in there as well so i just i really like these anchors out of all the ones i'm all now if you're using something heavier there are other anchors that you want to use um that are like a butterfly and i like those too but like I said, the process is so super, super simple, family. So all I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take out, I already took out the old screws that were sitting here. So I'm just gonna drill this in. All I'm gonna do, push it in and then just screw, see? And it's gonna automatically go in there. And I have my drill on the wrong setting or she would have heard it stop on its own, but I can, feel that so I'm gonna move it to the right setting and get it off hammer I definitely don't want it on hammer drill all right so that's the first one look at that it's in there now for the second one I gotta put it increase the torque on it there we go and it's in there now, all I do is get the screws. And on this particular holder here, I just put the screw back in the top right here. And each holder is different. And I'm going to screw it in. There we go. And look at that. It's good and tight. Now I can just take the curtain. And hang it back up. And voila. Figured I'd just show you this quick video. I had to do this. This right quick, it only takes a few minutes. Uh, originally, it only takes a few minutes to put it up anyway, but for the repair, again, those drywall anchors, they come in different sizes but for different weight. You know, they go out, they get as big as the whole 150 pounds. So it just depends on what your your um, need is. But anyway, I want to thank you for taking out the time, family, to check out the video. Thank you for your time. Don't forget, if this video is helpful to you, hit that like and subscribe button. 
Thank you again. Talk to you soon. Have a blessed day.